Day three. <laughs> and a new camera. Yeah. It's a big achievement. What is a big achievement? It's like, have you seen the cover? <laughs> <laughs> that. Yeah. That came with the original Canon camera packaging. We'll explain later. But it's an achievement that you know we've we've done. We've done this for three days. Yeah. Well, we usually just tap out on the first day yeah. of doing anything. So, yeah. We're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. Hang on, well, How do you know which way the frame is? Right? Absolutely no idea. So, we're just um, here at Ali's dad's shop. His furniture shop. Yeah. We're trying to assemble some chairs. Some chairs, yes. Yeah. Chairs, chairs. Chairs. We were just criticizing everything about the shop. <laughs> <laughs> How like the walls need like new paint, the display thing, I don't know, the glass needs like cleaning, these lights need to be changed. Like you need LED panels here. You need like spotlights on all these stuff. Yeah. I think that's that, that's our target as well. So you know, we probably um, because all the services that we provide for businesses yeah. is pretty much business services. Yeah. So might as well start at home. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we got his website done. We got his business card. That's true. <laughs> so might as well, you know. That's true. Get the business started. Yeah. So hopefully, hopefully, some sometime soon. Sometime in the future, soon, we will like I'll see these, sh see the shop turn into I don't know, I don't know what. Not Halfords. What's the what's the one? The, the House of Fraser or something. I don't know. House of Fraser is not a fucking furniture shop. Yeah, but like it looks classy. <laughs> <laughs> no, or Harrods. Bro, you're taking this somewhere too far. Now. <laughs> <laughs> when this classy? I don't. Okay, okay. I don't know. We'll do something about it. So what are we doing? <laughs> well, we basically, you know, um, trying to look up for um, letting agencies and phone them up and promote our business. Well, my dad's business, but yeah. Um. So we're just basically sitting here, and we just realised that most of the time, that when Ali's like here covering when his dad's out for deliveries, yeah. he's doing nothing. So <laughs> we just figured that why not just like pull up random, you know state agents and stuff and just like call them up and be like I don't know maybe like try and strike a deal with them or strike like a contract with them yeah, so uh, we're just cold calling random Neptune. people and we're trying to like I don't know find Definitely business okay shall we go call? yeah let's go call. Is there anything confidential here? No, not really. <laughs> uh, hey, uh, I'm calling from, uh, this is Ali calling from GB Furniture. I just want to know, have you got a contract with uh, any other furniture firm or anything? Ali from uh, uh, GB Furniture, we basically a new business that just started up and uh, we provide wholesale furnitures uh, to landlords and uh, a really cheap price. Uh, yeah, we do have that. So uh, I've got both. I've got booklets and the uh, email version. Email. Okay. Uh, could you just do, uh, drop me down your email? So. M A L A N E P T U N E. Uh, estate. Hold you can okay. Thanks a lot. Uh, what's your name? Marla. All right, okay, that's cool. Thanks a lot. I'll I will just email you the. Okay. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Bye. C, C. What's the email? progress already? This is the second call. Well, she was like, if you can, rather than calling them, we can just email them. 
Because yeah, she also wrote yeah. Russia. She was like, have you got these, those little booklets? Yeah. That you see the one that I showed yeah. you. So I've got the um, Photoshop version of those. Yeah. So what we can do is like turn them into PDF. Yeah. Well, actually they're... No, but I mean, my point is like, if you if you call them up, then they, they were expecting something in the email. Right. Rather than, if you just like, you know... Website, bro. <laughs> I think it's just the emails, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, now if you like uh, call them up, right? If you just email them, they, they'll probably just treat it as junk mail. So mm -hmm. they'll just like throw in the bin. They won't even look at it. So if you call them up and be like, you know, we're gonna send you an email now, mm -hmm. you know, they'll expect it and they'll like they're more likely to look at it. And there's a call. Ooh. That's my dad. That's my dad. <sighs> Still figure out ways to promote Alex's dad's business. Where's the ribbon? It's cute. <laughs> False advertising. It says blue ribbon properties, but there's no ribbon. Yeah. Uh, okay. Let's call I think this camera. Oh, huh? okay. Yeah. <laughs> the camera's quite nice. Oh, okay. Go for it. Side step. Side Hello, good afternoon. Um, I'm Sai calling from GBA Furnitures. Um, I got given your number from uh, a marketing company from Victoria. Pardon? Uh, I'm calling from GBA Furnitures. GBA Furnitures. Uh, we are just a new company starting up. I just wanted to know, uh, do you already have a contract with um, a furniture outlet? Uh, well, okay, well, um, in that case, uh, we're just a new company uh, starting up, so we are offering uh, cheap, uh, less than wholesale prices on all of our furniture. Hello? Okay, that's fine. So, uh, who do I post this Okay, excellent. Thank you. Bye. Did they just spit on your face? No, they <laughs> they said uh, uh, if you could post it to us, if you could post um, a brochure uh, mm -hmm. to our address, mm -hmm. then uh, the person who deals with uh, the furniture and stuff, they will deal with. Yeah. Can you do that? Yeah. Like you and see. That's the address, right? Wait, can we like print out all these booklets yeah. and like post it to them? Yeah. Would they give a notice? Mm, probably. If you put like a little letter along with it. Okay, so we need to print out a letter. Yeah. Well, just seem fake it. Just be like, you know, we got in contact with you again. You know, we called you up and you requested our, um, what's it called? Brochure. Catalog, brochure, whatever. Brochure, you yeah, brochure. It's not really catalog, really. Okay, brochure. Brochure, brochure. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it. Alright, I'll call you the next step. BTC letting. Man. Huh? The woman's starting to stop thing. How? She was like, where are you calling from? I was like, GBA Furniture. She was like, well, I've never heard of you. <laughs> yeah, okay. Alright, we mm. got you somewhere else. <laughs> <laughs> right, uh, right, you take it. Two. No, bro. Yep, take it. You need to learn how to deal, this, deal with this as well. You're going to be the, here, you know, sitting here by yourself. Days after days. Uh, hey, uh, this is Ali calling from GBA Furniture. Uh, I've got your contact details from uh, a, a market agency. Sorry. Hey, sorry. Uh, this is Ali calling from GBA Furniture. GBA Furniture. You're right. Uh, and uh, I've got your details from a marketing firm in Victoria. So, uh, just wanted to know, have you got any contract with any uh, furniture letting agency? Well, any contact with any, uh... right, so we basically a new business that we uh, started up, so we provide the uh, cheap uh, furniture to um, letting uh, in Wood Green. So uh, just wanted to know if you were interested in. You know. mm -hmm. Right, so do you, uh, what would you, do you want me to email you our prices or? Uh, so could I just take down your email, please? Info at Property Partners GB 
gmail.com. Okay. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Bye. Kill him. <laughs> well, she said that, you know, um, if your prices are yeah. reasonable. Yeah. Figuring out business. Business as usual. When are we going to start our one, man? Uh, hopefully in a few weeks' time. Before, definitely before the summer ends. We need to, we need to like, get on something. We need to get something done. This vlog's probably going to be boring because there's no Najmo in it. <laughs> <laughs> did you call him up? Honestly, yes, I did. He's not picking up. He's probably sleeping. He works like night shifts. Let's call him again. See what he says. Because there's literally everyone that I showed the previous video to, everyone goes that we are just boring. This is Najmo who's just the life of the party. Yeah. <laughs> boring, we're old souls. What are you going to do? <laughs> We are pretty much like, you know, we are the creative mind, yeah. but the we we can't present. Yeah. We need people it's like to present. Yeah. On the like, in, we're creative on the inside, but we've got like a very sort of kind of mature, kind of intellectual personality on the outside. So it's kind of hard for us to you know be all childish and be all entertaining and funny. I mean, we can be. We can be. You know. We can be quite entertaining at times, but you know. <laughs> Come on, pick up. Come on. Still sleeping. Still sleeping. Wake up. <laughs> He's probably going to see this later. He has to see this later. Did you just hang up? No, I think it got disconnected. Okay. Oh, yeah, well, we'll try later. <laughs> um, uh, getting weird looks from people because we've got a camera stuck in our face. But okay, anyways. No, that ah, one. that can be fine. The one on this side. <laughs> oh, no, yeah, that. Look how cheesy that looks. That's nice. Wow, there's, there's an entire collection of bottles, beer bottles, and wine bottles. They're all drunk nice. in that now. Yeah. So yeah, we're just trying to, I don't know, try and look for supplies to maybe like renovate his shop, maybe. I don't know. We're trying to give Before it like that, a nice need to renovate the van. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's just completely, completely. Yeah. Oh my god, you just need to look at the state of it. You, <laughs> you'd be like. <laughs> It's a garbage. <laughs> this is probably gonna be like a I don't know a video about building stuff and renovation and stuff. Oh well, I see what happens. Uh, no luck with finding supplies for like furbishing the shop, but um, we've got delivery now, so we're just going to the delivery, delivering a bed, I think. Yeah. See how it goes. <laughs> nice. Then you put it down. Huh? How did you put it down? Because that way it gets in the way. Like usually you put it like down there. Oh well. Ugh. Switching man, switching. <laughs> This is my first furniture delivery, so yeah. <laughs> Today you <laughs> That's good, that's good. But yeah man, the van needs some serious work. Yeah. Oh, we'll do something about it. <laughs>
So, um, that turned around quick. <laughs> Went to some old lady's house to um, set up her bed. Uh, apparently, there was a mix-up with the mattress. The mattress was too high for her. So, the delivery van has gone somewhere else to deliver something else. And we're now left to manually, on foot, old transport, <laughs> transport her old remainings of the bed to the shop and then transport on foot her new mattress back to her house and then on foot take her old mattress and then bring it back to the shop. Ah, fun. 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 <laughs> That's the setup we've got when transporting the mattress. <laughs> Check if there's traffic. Huh? Uh, nope, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yep, up. Ooh. <laughs> Why do we need to go to the gym, man? Might as well work with that. <laughs> That's exactly what I'm saying. These local shops, because they, you know, want to all assemble and stuff. Yeah. So, that was something. <laughs> Experience, bro. This is what I do every day. That was actually pretty hectic. The lady goes, she doesn't want the mattress, the mattress was too thick, so we had to carry the new mattress and now we're taking the, the other mattress that... Uh, I personally find this one better than the other one. Yeah, that is better, but I don't know. But that one's expensive. Yeah. And this one? Yeah. That's super old. <laughs> <laughs> Whew. It's a tough job. It's a tough job. I respect these guys for doing it. Putting up with these people. It's <laughs> cool. Alright, I'm gonna try and go and help him. It's no, just I was actually uh, thinking of uh, when I, I was gonna there. do this to actually film it. Yeah. And then I yeah. actually. <laughs> this is just one adventure to another. <laughs> now we're fixing Ali's van. Well, not my van. Well, I mean his dad's van, same thing. Bro, if it was my van, yeah, it would have, you know. Same difference. Oh, I was just trying to mount the camera here. Why is this so heavy? 
wasting the time. break unless someone <laughs> dashes something into it. Uh, so I got the No, 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 no. Right. So the hard work paid off. <laughs> and here we are. <laughs> Finally, man. I think the third day is probably the most productive day third day most productive day that we've done uh all right just hold on the camera i'm gonna help my dad okay it's been good we've been bob the builders all day kind of moving stuff so that's it um they're closing the shop now at least that is closing the shop now we've uh kind of tried to mend the van it, it was way worse, so we made it kind of better. <laughs> so yeah, testing if it works. <laughs> yep, works. Right. Uh, it's been a tough day, but it's been a good day. It's been a productive day. Yep. Um, this is now the end of the vlog. I guess so. Yep. You need so, to go for iftar as well, bro. Yep. Well, iftar is basically breaking up fast, so. So goodbye. Thanks a lot guys for watching. Please uh, subscribe. Subscribe please. Comment. Like the videos, comment, etc. etc.